Hey, my Twitch family, my YouTube family. Welcome back to another edition of Frodo Teabaggins, a Metalhead Reacts to Rap Music. So we're doing something a little different today. Um, I am really, really enjoying the Wu-Tang Clan. I think they're probably one of my favorite rap groups that I've heard in a long time. And um, I was uh, had a suggestion in the comments to do uh, uh, Riz's side project called Grave Diggers. And now Grave Diggers, apparently they have a song called Die of a Madman which is, you know, kind of a play on uh, Ozzy Osbourne's um, album of the same title, Diary of Madman. And apparently from what uh, was said is that they lean more towards like horror type elements and stuff. So I thought that sounded pretty damn interesting to me. I play a lot of Dead by Daylight, you know, on Twitch, and uh, it's one of my favorite games, and it's very horror themed. So I thought, hey, maybe, you know, that'd be kind of interesting to uh, check that out, to listen to that maybe, and to try it out. So today we're going to get into uh, Diary of a Man Mad uh, from Gravediggers and see, you know, what it's all about and check it out and see if I can pick up on it. And like I said, um, you know, RZA is probably one of the, you know, uh, I like all the Wu-Tang members, but, you know, he definitely has some really good, you know, really good lyrics and really good writing. So I'd like to see what he's going to do today. So we're going to pop this up on screen and we're going to get right into it. Let's check it out. Y'all ready for this? Gravediggers, here we go. judgment will the four defendants please rise and approach the bench okay trust me guys it's all under control the judge is my uncle he'll take the insanity plea oh yeah don't forget my retainer balance <laughs> okay all right okay i understand you guys are pleading insanity claiming all right beats going possess you to do these hideous murders Please explain to this court how these so-called spirits made you into these raving madmen. Be a witness as I exercise my exorcism. The evil that lurks within the sin, the terrorism. Possessed by evil spirits, voices from the dead. I come forth with grave diggers in a head full of dread. All right. I've been examined ever since I was semen. They took the sonogram and seen the image of a demon. Oh, shit. At birth, nurses surrounded me with needles and drugged me all up with the diseases of evil. Grew up in hell, now I dwell in an Islamic temple. I'm fighting a holy war in the mental. Look deep in my eyes, you see visions of death. Possessed by homicide is what I am obsessed. Giving niggas brain dimples. Dragging their asses on my hook by their temple. Oh, shit. The cause of death is unknown to the cops. Because when I kill them, I'm not leaving one element to a cop. First I'll assassinate him, and then I create him. And take all of his fucking ashes and evaporate. Damn, that's pretty damn dark right there. I mean, you start spewing that kind of stuff, they, they will definitely think you're insane. Or creep through the graveyard and hunt down your tombstone. Dig up your skeleton and stomp all your fucking bones. You try to haunt me, nigga, I ain't trying to hear it. Buck, buck, buck. I give your ass the Holy Spirit. <laughs> like that. Can you please explain to this court when these problems first began? The year, 84, November, day 10. Overwhelmed by the wicked inspirations of an evil gen. I realized my ideas has gone for 400 years of blood, sweat, and tears. I saw the torture, brood, and murder of my father. So my brain became stained with the horror. I'm having real current nightmares. I'm being soaking wet, slapped down to the electric chair. I got tackled with handcuffs and shackles and restraints in the bottom of a holy tabernacle. They gave me nothing to eat for two weeks and saw my eyelids open so I couldn't sleep. Wow. About to die from thirst, that's when the minute stopped. Pinch my jaws with a cold glass of vinegar. Ugh. Upon my wounds, they seasoned me with salt and melt my hands and feet to the form of a cross. Wow. I, I tried as the blood dripped inside of my eye, refusing to die. Visions of hell tormented my face, so I chewed my fucking arm off and made an escape. Damn. I, like, that's some serious guitar shit. Like, wow, I, I, I didn't expect this. Like, I really didn't expect this from rap music. No way, goddammit. Yeah. Into the realms of understanding and take good heed and you could bleed while I'm scanning. Three stages of pure hell, 50 cases of red cells. Yeah. Raindrops hit the pearls. Path is all in battle. You stalk by shadow. I pierce your skull with a fucking arrow. Damn. So narrow, only one could enter at a time. Stuck in the center, read the signs. A thousand doors to choose. You better hurry. Don't stop. Shit is getting hot as a pot of curry. <laughs> 
<laughs> yeah, where he's hot. Damn. Stroll through the dark conditions. I stone you till I see sparks and frictions. I chop you like a coal miner. Then combine the drug and mix it with your blood. Whoa. Some more. I give you some more and watch you crawl. Guts hit the floor. Worms exit your pores. I trick you. I, then I'm quick to syringe. Deep between my thoughts that bust out your skin. Wow. You scream. Portraits of inflictable pain. You can't stand. You're up to your hands and quicksand. You're sinking and sinking deep into the earth. Thoughts was possessed since the first day of birth. My mental says it's my turn to possess the matter. Stab you with a dagger up Jacob's ladder. Wow, that's that's really freaking that's really impressive. That's really impressive to me. You guys might not know it. There's uh, and you probably wouldn't even listen to it, but there's a band called Cannibal Corpse. Okay, Cannibal Corpse is a death metal band. They'd be really hard to understand, but if you listen to them, you know, uh, if you listen to one of their songs and read the lyrics, you'd get it. These guys, to me, the Grave Diggers here are very similar in what they talk about to Cannibal Corpse. And I find that really fascinating, really fascinating. If you guys want, there's a really good Cannibal Corp song called Evisceration Plague. You should uh, check it out and pull it up with lyrics. And it, you'll see kind of like the same kind of undertones here. It, it's freaking cool. It's really cool. I'm really enjoying this. Thoughts become shattered, confused and tragic. Fiery thoughts of grave diggers. Guilty. Next case. Oh, snap. Okay. Well, damn. That was really freaking good. Another another good suggestion, guys. Another good one. Like I said, I'm going to get into all the Wu-Tang members because I am loving their stuff. I really am loving their stuff. You know, and it's like I, I, I missed out on so much good rap music over the years, you know. And I am love coming in with an open mind. And I really appreciate your guys' suggestion because I, my wife doesn't know much about rap. And I don't know much about rap. So for me, it's really cool to, you know, for people that know it, for you guys that know it, that you can help me on a journey to say, hey, these are really good songs. These are the songs we enjoy. And maybe you'll enjoy them too. And I really appreciate you guys taking the time out to, uh, you know, come and check out my reactions and hang out with me for a little bit. And you can always follow me on Twitch, Twitter, YouTube. You know, um, uh, I'm I go live a lot on Twitch. So if you ever want to stop by there and you know chat with me while I'm playing some Dead by Daylight, it's really cool to do. But I'm actually serious about this, guys. Open your mind, like I am. Listen to the band Cannibal Corpse, okay? And and give them a shot. I mean, yeah, it's going to sound like a lot of screaming and growling and stuff, and I understand that. But if you listen to the lyrics or have the lyrics up while you're hearing the song, you might see a connection here, like. A very similarity to the grave diggers and I, I think that'll be pretty interesting for you but you guys need to try it out but anyway i just want to say thanks again and you know what until then i'll catch you guys next time